Do you like cemeteries at night? How about devil babies? Well, if the answer was yes to either or of those questions, please stay tuned for tonight's special Halloween episode of... So we are heading to Ravenswood, West Virginia to look for the grave of the Devil's Baby. Mason, you set us up because you're the one that's been researching this. Um, okay. The baby's name is George Elwood Sharp. It was born, uh, I think March 7th of 1915. And it died, I forget the date, but sometime in 1917, so it was only a little over two. And, uh... So why they call it the Devil's Baby? Well, because... This is scary. Mm. Um, because at, when the, the moon shines on the tombstone, it glows and makes it look like it has horns and fangs. Gotcha. Okay. And, uh, at 12 o'clock at midnight, you can hear a baby cry. Hear a baby cry. Horns and fangs and a glowing tombstone. Oh. Supposedly. Supposedly. <laughs> Alright. I'm a firm believer that you don't go looking for crap that you don't want to find, right? <laughs> Do you know why I'm okay with us doing this right now? Why? Because I am 110% confident. No questions asked. Money back guarantee that this is all horse crap. <laughs> I don't think we're going to find anything. I think we're going to hear a baby cry. You think we're going to hear a baby cry? I do believe it. I can make you cry. Oh, is that <laughs> how it is? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. But you know, that seems like all the other legends. Uh, there was one from Point Pleasant where at midnight you can hear a train go by. Did you do that? And it happened? No. Oh, I thought you did. No, we did it, but it, it, it wasn't what they said it was. Um, there's just, it's like every legend. Oh, right at midnight. That's when you hear it. That's when you see it. That's why I call bullcrap on it. I just, I, I think it's dumb. There's probably a grave. Uh, the glowing thing. That might be true. That, they say that I mean, because it's weathered a lot. Okay, so that's not even scary then. So it yeah, grows fangs and horns, though. Well, yeah, that's the scary part. Only when it's only when the moon is shining on the tombstone is when it has horns and fangs. Oh, okay, only when the moon is shining. All right, that well, sounds good. Let's see what we find. It's open till nine. Okay. All right. Well. Oh, dang it. She said, right as she was going around the turn to the left, right? Down over the hill? Okay. I want to show you some of these old tombs. What? It's a pretty old. Pretty old tombs here. 1816. This one's pretty elaborate. Eighteen twenty one, eighteen eighty two. Oh, this is from the seventeen hundreds. Some 
1955 maybe. Oh, it's too warm to tell. Die. P R O T H E R shall rise again. I don't know what that word is. That is an H, yeah. Is it? Yeah. Prither? I don't know. If that's not a B, I don't know, unless they messed that up. Ravenswood has a whole bunch of history dating back to 1700s, George Washington's time. Um, a Civil War skirmish happened right outside the uh, town. Uh, and this is apparently the only graveyard in the town, so there's, um, there's a lot of very old graves here. What all can you read on that one? I can only read where it says Germany. It does say Germany, yeah. And then May 14th. That's all I can read. I can't tell what. It says 17 or 1883. Birth date. Joseph Rule. Did you find it? Yeah. Okay. Got the uh, the ghost crew here with us, Clary and Natalie. The professionals in this. Oh, that don't look. That's not it. Are you sure? That don't look anything like the picture. Oh, that is. They said that the first thing everybody notices is the white out eyes, but at night it appears that he has the ones. Mm-hmm, and things. I feel like I can see that. I can see that from clear up at the car, that's why I told you to go look at this one. Wow. Did you hear scream? Yeah. <laughs> Who's waiting now? You're so getting haunted now. Picture of it too. Hmm. Mine's for research purposes. Hers is out of morbid curiosities. I have morbid curiosities. <laughs> so we can't stay till midnight. Yeah. It's creepy. Maybe after nightfall, we'll still hear. Kind of cute. <laughs> kind of like Mason's, you know, kind of creepy and cute. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't look yeah, they had those. So at least Right now, it's nothing but black on my camera. And he's glowing now. <laughs> which is just because there's a big orange light right behind it. But if you put your hand there, it's still kind of glowing. Not on my phone, it's not. What? The only scary thing is the horde of geese. Okay, so now how did they make that picture? They took the actual picture and laid it on top of a piece of ceramic put it in a hot furnace uh -huh. and they left it there and the ink soaks through onto the ceramic and it was supposed to stay for a hundred years but that wasn't the case for us right i still don't get it sitting around we're just i know he acts like he's scared i don't get it we're... <laughs> i kind of am why we're in a well-lit cemetery right in the middle of town. It's not that spooky. <laughs> if one of us go down, we're all going down. I know. I hate them. I hate cemeteries. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Mason. So we had to take off, but what do you think? I think it's real. You, you think it's real? <laughs> Well, you were being a sissy. What? You were being a sissy. I wasn't afraid. You're the one. Yeah, I'm afraid. <laughs> Literally, I got that on video. <laughs> Shut up. I don't like cemeteries. I don't. But, um, I mean, what, what else was going to happen? Uh, first of all, the horns and the fangs thing was kind of debunked. Uh, the light thing was definitely debunked. So what, why would we hear a baby cry? Why wouldn't we? I, <laughs> well... <laughs> Two strikes against the three. I'm going to say we wouldn't have heard it. Who's the three? Uh, the uh, horns and the fangs and growing and the light. The fangs did, or the horns did grow. I didn't see them when we first. Yeah, okay. 
guess that's one of the things you you just gotta want to see or you gotta want to believe. Yeah, well, we'd actually stay. Yep, I guess you're right. We didn't do it scientifically.